Hello whiskey lovers and welcome to another one of Mark's Whiskey Ramblings. Today I would like to talk to you about a distillery that I have not talked to you about in quite a while and that is in fact the Beast of Dufftown. I'm here to talk to you about a Mortlach release. Mortlach is one of those distilleries in Dufftown founded in 1827. It was actually the very first distillery in Dufftown and it's Mortlach was named after the after the parish that was there, St. Moloch Parish. And now as, as the Dufftown village grew into a city, the name of Mortlach became a little bit unknown, except for the distillery, which kept its name. And now for the longest time, George Cowie was the owner of the Mortlach distillery. And a few years later, he brought in his son, Alexander. And this Mortlach, 14 years old, is dubbed Alexander's Way. What is that all about? Well, Alexander's way is actually, he was an engineer and he reconfigured the Mortlach distillery and he found this, this special way of distillation that makes Mortlach 2.81 times distilled. Now it's a fine dishly complex uh, distillation process and, and one that I am far too, um, too much of a layman to be able to explain it to you, but I'll do the second best thing. I will ask an expert and the guy who is going to explain this fine dishly complex distillation process to us is none other than the brand ambassador for Mortlach in Belgium, Mr. Arno Dobbles. So please, please Arno, explain it to us as if we are six year olds. Thank you, Mark. I'll try and explain this as easily and as simply as possible. It's an intricate process, I know, but I believe I can explain it in a, in a way that everybody can understand. You could say that actually at Mortlark, there's three distilleries going into the one still house. There are six stills in the still house and they all have different shapes and sizes. There are three wash stills and three spirit stills. Wash still three and spirit still three are interconnected. They produce a moderate multi spirit, which is double distilled. So far, so good. What comes out of wash till one and wash till two is split into two parts. The first lighter part we call the heads. The second heavier part we call the tails. The heads coming out of wash till one and two are redistilled in spirit still two. They form a double distilled, floral, very light new make spirit. So far so good. We have some tails left coming out of the wash still one and two, and we redistill that in spirit still number one, the smallest still in the still house, we call the Wee Witchy. The Wee Witchy produces now a spirit which is heavy, thick, and muscular, and it's double distilled. We mix that immediately together with another set of heads coming out of wash still one and two, and redistill that again. So we have a slightly more moderate, you could say, uh, spirit, which is double distilled and triple distilled. We then have some tails left coming out of wash till one and two. We redistilled that again together what came out of Wee Witchy. So what we produce there is a very thick, muscular new make spirit, which is double, triple and quadruple distilled. These Three different new make spirits are then blended together into the one to produce the, the, the new make spirit and the complexity that Mortlach is known for, which we call 2.81 distilled. So Mark, I hope that explains a little bit the intricate process uh, that's going on at Mortlach and uh, may the mold be with you. Slanje. Well, thank you very much, Arno. I, I hope that makes it clear for you. I'm not entirely sure that I understand, but still, I hope that makes it clear for you. It's the one we're going to be trying today, which is the Mortlach 14 years old Alexander's Way 2.81 distilled. And this is bottled at 43.4% ABV. Well, now, look at that color. And that's obviously from the sherry casks in the mix, of course, because Mortlach is well known for its sherry matured whiskey. It's umami spirit as well. So let's find out if this is, is any good. The Mortlach 14 years old, which originally was only available as a uh, travel retail, but nowadays it's quite easy to find. So let's find out the Alexander's Way, Mortlach 14 years old at 43.4% ABV. Copper color on the nose.
Well, that's, that's, that's quite an accessible nose. A bit sweet and sour at the same time. I get some plums and some raisins. Oranges kick in. Lots of them. Make that orange juice. Some brown sugar and, and, and some green garden herbs, in fact. Oh, but it's very nice and it's very... I'll, I'll, I'll be honest, this is not as umami as I thought it would be. But it's very lovely. It's typical space side. Like some gingerbread now. And it even has a pinch of salt all the way in the back. It's gone before you realize it. But all in all, I think this is a very beautiful nose on the palate. Mmm. Oh, nicely oily. Almost creamy, in fact, on the palate. I get some breakfast cereals with oranges again. I get some cedar wood. Some, some earthy notes as well, and even a wonderfully sweet, fruity note. But now I get that salty edge even more than on the nose. It's, it's more pronounced now. And it does give this more like some extra depth. And while again, it is not as umami as some of the old Mortlachs that I've tried, it is creamy, it is full, it's rich, flavorsome. I quite like it on the finish. Rather short, but even though the finish is rather short, it does offer some beautiful notes of honey and, and some chewing tobacco even, and raisins at the death. Well, it's a very charming and very friendly priced Mortlach, that's for sure. Uh, so if you do get the chance to try the Mortlach 14 years old Alexander's Way, don't miss out. And that's all for this Whisker Rambling, and I hope to see you at one of Mark's Whisker Ramblings real soon. And until then, may the mob be with you. Bye-bye.